A frightening study proves that about 40% of in vitro fertilizations in the United States could be causing serious problems with absolutely no benefit to the hopeful parents. I'm Kimberly Wallison, and that's next on Insider's Health News. If you or someone you know has gone through in vitro fertilization, you understand just how challenging the process is. But it turns out that our doctors might be putting that burden on their patients by using more embryos than necessary, increasing the cost and the chance of injury. Researchers in a British study found that 40% of IVF done in the United States involved the transfer of three or more embryos, with 20% of those pregnancies resulting in multiple births. And as soon as you start talking about multiple births, you have to talk about the enormous health risks and expenses that are attached to these pregnancies. So can anything be done? It seems like the answer is actually quite simple. Two embryos is all we really need. After looking at over 124,000 procedures that resulted in almost 35,000 live births, researchers came to some interesting conclusions. Among all women, the transfer of two embryos resulted in more births than the transfer of one. But transferring three embryos actually produced a lower rate of birth than with two and was associated with a significantly higher risk of complications, including preterm birth and low birth weight. This basically boils down to 40% of the IVF procedures in our country being unnecessarily expensive and dangerous. In fact, the U.S. is one of the few countries in which more than two embryos are still routinely used during the transfer. So while it might seem like the more the merrier when it comes to in vitro, you're better off keeping the number at two. That's it for this edition of Insider's Health News. I'm your host, Kimberly Walston, and remember, it's your health. We're just helping you think outside the docs.